Good morning, everybody. So I have a huge exam this morning and I'm like really stressed out, but it'll be fine. Once it's over, I feel like I'm just gonna feel so much better. I've been like studying all week. Yesterday, I spent four or five hours in like the library with a tutor, just like trying to make sure I know everything for my finance class. And it was like really stressing me out, but it's okay because I'm taking my test this morning, but I just want to start off my weekend vlog right now and just vlog a little bit. It's so cold and look what I'm wearing. I had to bring out my winter jacket because it's so cold outside and I was like trying to wear a sweatshirt and joggers to class, but I was like, I literally can't do that because it's so cold out. Um, so I have on my jacket and then I'm just wearing these Lululemon lines and um, this like free people crop top. And then I'm wearing Emma's shoes this morning. They're just these blue NMDs and they're really cute and I like them a lot and they just add like a little pop of color to my outfit. But I have a little bit of time left before I need to go and take my exam. It's actually at 9.30 and it's 8.30 right now so I'm gonna go and study and like do some last minute things before that. And I will talk to you guys later. My classes are finally over and all of my tests are over for the week so I'm literally so happy. Ugh. It just feels like a breath of like fresh air to not have like to worry about anything. Well, right now I obviously have finals and like more things this semester, but just like everything that I needed to do this week is all done. Now I'm gonna work out. I don't really know what I'm gonna do yet. I did legs on Tuesday, Soul Cycle Monday, legs Tuesday. I think I yeah I took the day off Wednesday because I was studying, and then yesterday I did arms. So today I might do like a long ab workout and maybe like a butt workout. I've been really loving this wrap lately from the juice mill like after I work out or just like for lunch during the day and I've been eating it a lot lately. And I probably should like go grocery shopping just buy the ingredients because it's so easy to make But I've been like so busy this week that I just have been buying it because I didn't have time to grocery shop But yeah, anyway, so it's just a hummus and veggie wrap and they have like spinach and um, cucumbers tomato banana peppers hummus inside a wrap and it's a sun-dried tomato wrap and it literally is the best sandwich ever and it's like keeps you full It's really really light. I really like it a lot So if you guys are looking for like a healthy lunch to make during the day like when you have school and stuff I highly recommend like going to the store and buying all these ingredients and making a wrap like this because they're really 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 yummy So I just took a shower. I feel so clean. I put on self tanner I don't know if you guys can tell but I'm like already feeling really bronze and tan and Kaylee's drinking a coffee and it looks so good right now but I already drank my yeah, coffee what kind this morning. It is? what kind? gingerbread man I've never tried it literally it like looks really really good it tastes like pumpkin I like want it but I just took oh I'm gonna turn this light off because the lighting gets like weird when I am filming in yeah. the bathroom um but I just want to show you guys like my cleansing skin routine just because I feel like my face feels so clear and clean and I sw have been switching up my products I told you guys that I got a bunch of new products the other day and now I'm trying out like some new cleansing products which I've used before but I'm just gonna show you guys I just use the cleanser in the shower but what I'm doing right now is I'm using the bio clarity routine again and right now I'm using the essentials routine and what they have is the essentials routine and then they also have like the clear skin routine I don't know if that's like the name of it but basically there's one for like acne prone skin and one for normal skin I'm using the normal skin one but I did use the acne one back when I had acne and it basically what it is it's like a three-step little routine and I'm just trying to find all my products in my Oh, they're, wait, they're right in front of me. But um, my moisturizer's in my car because I wore that this morning, but I'll just explain it to you guys and show you because I don't need the moisturizer right now because I'm gonna be going in my car. But basically I just cleanse my face with the cleanser and it has cucumber, green tea, and chamomile in it. It just is like really natural ingredients and it's vegan and just really good for your skin. And what it does is it literally brings out all of like the goodness in your skin because there are so many vitamins and like nutrients in it that it literally is like a green juice for your skin that's how like basically the only way to describe it 
And so after I cleanse my skin with the cleanser, I go in with this um, Restore Gel right here. And basically what it is, is it's Floralux, which is a form of chlorophyll. And it's literally just going to get rid of all the redness. A bird just flew by my window. It was like blue. <laughs> it's so weird. But um, it is just going to like get rid of all the redness and just make your skin really even. Like I don't know if you guys can tell. I don't really have any like red patches or anything like that. It just is really nice. So I just take two pumps of that when my skin is completely clean. And as you can see on my hand, it's like green because of the Floralux. And then once you like rub it in, it gets rid of the color and it actually is clear on your skin. But this product is so hydrating. My skin has been really dry lately. So this has just been helping with my dry skin. And then after that, they also have a gel, like moisturizing cream, but it's just in my car right now. And then I also got a mask from BioClarity that I used last night. And it is the clarifying mask and it is like a pore purifier. It has Floralux, tea tree, and aloe. And I'll show you guys what it looks like. It's just like a bright green mask and it really just like brings everything out of your skin. Like I have two little marks right there just because it like literally cleared out my pores. And I woke up and had like little thing to like pop and get out and then my skin is just going to be clear. But those are the products that I've been using recently and I've been loving them. And Kaylee uses them as well. You guys obviously know my best friend Kaylee. She loves them and she has been using the um, Floralux also like religiously. And her skin has looked so good. So I was like I need to start using that again. And I like to switch up my skincare routine like during the summer and during the winter just because I feel like during the winter I need like something more I can't just use like the light products that I use during the summer so this is definitely been working for my skin right now I just love it and also the cleanser is foamy and I feel like it just like really works I wasn't using a foaming cleanser before and when you don't use one that foams I feel like it just doesn't do its job and isn't cleaning your face but I've been loving these products, so if you guys want to try them out, you can use my code. I have a code that you can um, click the link in the description and get 40% off of your order. And then also if you use my code Maggie50, you get an extra 15% off your order of BioClarity. So you guys should totally take advantage of that offer just because it's such a good deal with all the discounts and stuff. Um, but yeah, if you guys end up using it, let me know how you like it and if it like cleared up your skin and all that because I would love to know because it works like really well for my skin. And I'm really happy with it. And I'm really happy with the way that my skin looks right now. So I just want all of you guys to feel that way about your skin. I'm driving right now in the car through Boston. Um, to go actually look at an apartment potentially for Emma and I when I'm done with school and when she's done with school but yeah so I'm going to do that right now I'm really excited I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like it's a brand new building the apartments are all brand new there's like 12 units in the building and none of them are rented so right now I'm gonna go look at one of them it is a two-bedroom and what I would want to do was maybe even move in there earlier than next year and just try to like get in there as soon as possible. I just feel like living in Boston is like what makes sense for me. Like I'm so happy when I'm here. I honestly feel like it's literally feels like home to me and I just like can't wait to live here. So yeah, I'm hoping this apartment, I don't know, I'm gonna see what the size is because I would like to get a two bedroom for myself and then have it be like one of the rooms, my bedroom, one of them, my office, and then have like the kitchen living area and then have Emma just get an apartment in the same unit as me instead of sharing it and having like really small space. But we'll see obviously like what it looks like when I get there. But I'm really excited. <laughs> it's such a nice day out. It's so pretty. I wish I could have like spent longer time in the city and like taken pictures or something, but it's okay.
spot and this happens. There's legit a sea of people. <laughs> oh my god, they literally won't stop. <laughs> what? I'm not kidding you guys, there was legit 30 of them. 30 people on those like things going through the city. Good morning everybody. I am on my way to Soul Cycle right now. It's 8 o'clock. Saturday, October 27th. And I feel like so rested. I went to bed last night at like 9 o'clock. It was really weird. Tyler was watching the World Series game. Red Sox at um in LA playing the Dodgers and I fell asleep at like 9 o'clock and I slept and I woke up like by myself at 6 30 it was really weird but I feel like so rested and so good and I just got to Starbucks and I ordered some food and a coffee to eat for Soul Cycle just because I need to eat something before I go and I'm wearing this really cute set that they sent me um it's a beach riot set the pants are a little bit big but they're super high-waisted like i wish that you guys could see them on because they're really high-waisted and they really suck you in and they feel so good and like light but they're a little bit big on me because they're medium and i should have gone like i should be wearing a small but it's fine it's not a big deal i'm gonna make them work but i'm really excited for dating for today's class it is soul survivor which if you guys like aren't familiar with soul cycle there's soul cycle soul survivor and Soul Activate, and Soul Cycle is a 45 minute class, Soul Survivor is an hour class, and then Soul Activate is like, I don't know what that really is. Is that person gonna hit me? Um, but I don't really know what Soul Activate is, I haven't done it yet, but usually the regular Soul Cycle classes are only um, 45 minutes long, but this one is an hour long, so I'm really excited. It's with Sarah, I love her. And yeah, so I'm just waiting. I ordered my Starbucks like on the app, and it should be ready in, oh, it should be ready soon, it says. It will be ready. But I'm really excited for today. <laughs> Nothing like a rainy walk to Seoul. It kind of feels nice though, not complaining. But I'm excited to take this class. I feel like I haven't been to Seoul Cycle in forever, but I was literally here last week. <laughs> the best class ever and I, I know I say that after every single class that I do but I feel like it just like keeps getting better and better sorry I just put gum in my mouth um I know you guys hate when I or I don't want to vlog and like chew gum because it gets kind of gross and yeah but I'm sorry so anyway class was really good it was really really challenging but I feel like I like that in a class like I want it to be hard and be able to push myself and like I can feel myself getting stronger, which I like. And I don't know, it just felt really good. And Sarah's like the most amazing instructor. So if you guys are ever in Boston, take a Soul Cycle class with Sarah and let me know if you're, you guys like want to take one because I love taking them with her and like we can take them together sometime. But um, yeah, the class went really well and the set held up amazing. It was the best like feeling set ever. It's like so seamless and like light on your body. And when you sweat, it like doesn't get wet in, I don't know, I feel like when workout clothes get wet, especially during Soul Cycle, they get like uncomfortable. I'm gonna cross the street. Um, because they don't like dry, but this material, not that it like dried all the way, but you just like, I don't know, it like didn't weigh you down. So it was really good. But I was gonna stay after and do her Soul Activate class, but I'm kind of nervous because I've never done it before. And it's like a high intensity interval training, like a HIIT class. And I just like wasn't ready for that today because I kind of hurt my hamstring yesterday when I was working out. So I was like, you know what, an hour class is enough for me today because I already did more than I like normally would have. So, whatever. Oh, not today. I really like my playlist, the winter playlist. Yeah. It's called Winter 2017 in 2018. I always get confused with my password and your password. Because um, they both start with a six. I like this song. Okay, everybody, I just took a shower. No power. Yeah, no power. Tyler just lost power at his house. And I was like talking to his dad and then all of a sudden the like lights just shut off and it was really kind of scary because it was like kind of dark outside and then it got all dark inside and uh, 
but we're gonna go get some lunch now and I finally just showered and Tyler did a workout when I was at SoulCycle doing a workout. We decided, I'm like still have a cough, I've had a cough for two weeks, but we decided that Saturday mornings we're gonna like work out just because it feels good like working out on the weekends. I kind of like, like it because it makes you feel like you like got up and did something and like started it off on like a productive good note instead of just like being lazy and, and like not doing anything but and then just like lets you be able to chill for the rest of the day which I really like it's really nice but we're gonna go get some lunch right now and I'm wearing this jacket that a lot of you guys have been asking me on Instagram and it's from Zara and it's from Zara my camera's gonna fall because we're going on a turn but and I'm wearing this new shirt that I just got from Brittany Melville I just got a bunch of new things when I was in Boston I got a shirt that's just cropped I'll show you it's cropped and it has um, little buttons on the front and it's a long sleeve and I got a, I have it in white and it's a short sleeve one but I feel like I need to like start wearing long sleeves more in the winter just because obviously it's like cold out so I'm wearing this and then I got new gray joggers and these ones are just super fuzzy and they're kind of darker than the ones I have and the ones I have have like pills on them like inside the legs because um, I wash them and dry them which don't dry them like my new ones that I've gotten I just hang them to dry and then they don't get pilly and they stay like super soft and then I'm wearing these little um, what are these called Adidas NMDs these ones are actually Emma's the blue ones. so Emma <laughs> she's gonna see this and be like don't take my clothes but whatever in Tyler's car he has like this sticker that's an American flag and it used to be on the back of his car but then he decided he didn't want it there anymore and like didn't know where else to put it so he kind of just like had it sitting here and then it just like stuck it in and it like looks really cool and I was at Brandy today and I got him a little mini one because <laughs> it reminded me of the one that was in his car but I told him he could cut the Brandy Melville part off but he wants to keep it it looks cute I like it oh <laughs> I really like it on there Want to update you guys update. on <laughs> update update you on my skin because I don't know it just like feels so good today and I know yesterday I showed you guys my new like skincare routine and I also had a message on Instagram that's jeez uh, mom I didn't see grandma walking across the street oh god Hila um, I got a message on Instagram from one of you guys and you said like do I still use Amari Badescu cleanser on my face and I actually like responded back and I said no because one I just didn't really think it like really cleaned my face and I just really like the cleanser I've been using and I really like um, the restore gel like the floor Lux. I just feel like my skin feels so like good and it just looks so like even except for underneath my eyes like they're red because I got my eyebrows threaded but I just wanted to like tell you guys that I really like my skincare like I obviously have been using it for so long and I used it again today my skin just like feels really nice oh it's right there oh wow now I know where we are I like really really miss this song After we got home from lunch, I like went and took a nap because there was like a monsoon outside today and it was a, what was that called? A nor'easter? A nor'easter. And I was like laying and Tyler was like, oh, like let's go to DSW. Like I want to get a new pair of shoes and like saying all this stuff. And I was like, why would we go outside again in the nor'easter when we could just go tomorrow and it's really sunny out. And yeah, but we're going to go out to dinner. Now that's why I'm like all dressed up um, and the Red Sox are playing it's game of four of the World Series And this is what I'm wearing. I like really really like my outfit tonight. It's something different than like I've ever worn 
just because it's like winter now so i kind of have to wear like jeans and stuff like that but um i don't know why i'm saying it's different than anything i've ever worn i'm just saying it because i'm wearing new shoes but i'm wearing these new hoops that i got and they're from target guys they're going to be in my big like fall haul that i'm going to be posting probably next week sometime um, but these were literally six dollars and they're amazing and this is the lip that you guys like helped me pick out from Fenty And then I'm just wearing this bodysuit from Princess Polly my little YSL bag these jeans that are from Abercrombie And I really like them and then I'm wearing Doc Martens with it And I never knew that I would like the way that like these look on me, but I really like this outfit I feel like it's gonna be like one of my go-to's just these jeans with Doc Martens and a like, black shirt or bodysuit or something. dinner that the Red Sox were gonna win seven to four and right now it's four to three Dodgers are winning but we will see what happens if they win seven to four that's gonna be insane good morning everybody it's Sunday I've been saying the date in my videos Sunday October 28th my birthday soon <laughs> and I just ordered a coffee from Starbucks um, and we're picking it up right now, but I don't want to get out of the car because I'm like kind of cold because my hair is still wet. But I'm just really tired today and I have an essay due tomorrow at 12 or 11.59 a.m. My teacher's like so weird and makes things due at 11.59 a.m. when literally everything else online is usually due at my school at 11.59 p.m. So I have a five page essay due tomorrow. And I've had so many assignments due like the past week Like for my finance and my accounting classes and stuff And so like I haven't done my essay because It's for my online dance class and I just like kind of didn't make it a priority because it's like Not for my major it's kind of just like an extra class I'm taking for like credits But now I like waited till last minute because I had so many midterms and assignments and it's just like Now I'm gonna have to do it today but What do the pages play? Monday Oh Oh, so usually Tyler watches football on Sunday and I can like get work done, but no, the Patriots don't play today. So, whatever, but I need to check to see if my coffee's done. It's almost done. It says, look, I really should change the name too because whenever they call me, they're like Margaret, but it's done soon. What kind? Oh. <laughs> I used to love those. This is the kind that I want. Oh my god, remember that one? The salt, sea salt, and cracked pepper. You wanted sour cream and onion? Oh, god, no. oh. well, what kind did you want? Can you go? This one. You not like this? Oh, you don't. Okay. Because I know that you don't like the sea salt and cracked pepper ones awesome. from last time. And they don't have the jalapeno. Unless we like go actually down the aisle and look. This is sweet and spicy. And those are infused. I don't know the difference between them though. What the heck are these? Oh. If you are a channel, please scan the box located above the monitor before scanning. Seriously. Oh. Can I hold my bag? No, no, that will be fine. Please, Tyla. Come on, this guy got a park right next to him. Race you to the car. We just got Cape Cod chips because we couldn't find them anywhere. And I got salt and vinegar. 
I'm excited to try these. I've never had these before. Whoa! That was a nice little steal, Ty. You're welcome. Wow, that was so special. I got all the goods. I'm so hungry. It's two o'clock and I did literally you get that? woke okay, up at I'm nine. Right. Yeah, we did. But I woke up at nine and I am so hungry and I just drank coffee like uh, two hours ago. Or like at like eleven thirty actually. Then we went to DSW. Yeah, it was like a little bit two hours ago. And I'm so hungry and I haven't eaten, but we have our sandwiches and our chips. So the prime Sunday <laughs> meal. What? Everyone's gonna be like, Tyler, read a sound. So I'm going to bed right now, but the Red Sox are playing in the World Series right now. And what's the score? Four to one? And it's four to one, and we're winning, and it's the top of the seventh inning. So hopefully they win, but I really need to go to bed because I have to get up so early tomorrow and get a coffee and drive back to school so I can go to class and then do my essay. But yeah, I'm really not excited for that. I literally have to leave like 5.45. We'll have to wake up at 5.45. I have to leave at like 6, but whatever. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know you guys have been liking like my weekend vlogs, so if you guys want to keep seeing them, like I'll keep doing them for you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching video and I'll see you guys in the next one.